careful on your wheel, Chris. Yeah. Chris, 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 stop, stop, stop. When he said he was going to climb Kilimanjaro, I thought, well, how are you going to do that? Kilimanjaro is described as a walkable mountain. Walking's all well and good if you can walk. And that for me is the, is the obstacle. I don't look at a disabled person and say that person's disabled. I look at a disabled person and say, what can they do? They can do a lot. I think that climbing the highest mountain on the African continent says a tremendous amount about ability. If he makes Kilimanjaro the climb, I think that's huge. But if he makes this foundation work, that's much bigger. The hope is to shine a light back on the disabled community. We all share certain shortcomings. Some are more visible than others. You see somebody in Africa that maybe doesn't have that wheelchair to get him around the village. I broke my back about 20 years ago, yeah, so it damaged the spinal cord. I think that the story is one that needs to be told. People with disabilities can do anything they want to do. I think that he's taking the common paradigm of disability. There it is. And he's standing it on its head. Well, maybe because if you're disabled, you can't climb killing. Well, that's it. And the question is, how high can you climb?